Hello, I am Simon. On Friday the 2nd of June 2023, we met up with our friend Sean Webster as I had come up with the idea to do a film chatting about our early days meeting up back in 2020. Sean's words at the time were the catalyst for our cycle of co-production. I'm, hi, I'm Adam. I've met Sean after watching his videos and reading a chapter of his book. He's purchased Father Sean's. He's inspired me to learn new things and get to get involved with things to do. Uh, I am Sean Webster. I have an MBE. I also have a learning disability. I got dyslexia and short-term memory issue. I am an author and a campaigner, campaigner for the rights of people with learning disabilities. In 2020, I joined over 50 people for a very special Zoom session. We, we explore subjects such as uh, 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 living in the pregnant, sexuality, employment, and we, we discuss making a, we discussed making and and a relationship, and then I join other people with learning disability every Wednesday and Friday to talk about human rights. This was our Zoom as we were in Corvin bubble at the time. I spoke about my experience of living with with a learning disability. In 2020 to 2022, as COVID-8 were started daily Zoom session throughout 2020 and 2021, a lot of people have fun at the session that were interesting. I, to tell you the truth, it got me through COVID and being alone and not being isolated and made new friends. Every Tuesday we have met meeting on Zooms with other communities and, and life opportunities. We have started to co-produce settings to help share what we mean all of us. We also met every Friday for a session called Thinking Out Loud, which gave people the opportunity to talk about anything. We turned a lot of people's ideas into actions. This included putting together some I statements and ensuring that in the future everyone worked together as equals. Hope you enjoyed part one, looking at how our I statements were created. We also have part two called the process of putting together our 10 I statements. And finally, we have part three, what are we going to do next? This presentation does have some imperfections. However, through these imperfections, we can find the true meaning and value of co-production.